Victor, what are you doing here? I forgot the ring in my desk. Oh. Uh, don't forget, 7 o'clock nice. shop. Okay. We wouldn't miss it for the world. Don't worry, Greg. You look like a million bucks. Huh? Ginger's very lucky. You can't say something nice. Don't say anything at all. Forget it. I take it back. Cagney, the lieutenant's looking for him. And he checked the ladies. Lieutenant Sergeant Palman said he would testify against Colt. Immaterial. Beck, sir, this is a genuine break in the case. You didn't need Palman. Your final tests came back negative. What a surprise. Now I'm left with a situation where two of my detectives violated a direct order. Oh, good. I have to consider the consequences. You realize that, don't you? Now I can tell you what the book says I should do. What do you think I should do? All he wanted was an apology. He should apologize to us. He didn't have to go through all that crap to prove himself innocent. He didn't have to sit across from that pig in IAD with his life split open and spat on. Yeah, it still feels like there's somebody watching us. What do we have left to hide? Did you get your gun and shield back? Sure. In fact, they had to crawl on my hands and knees to beg for it. Hey, Chris, don't we have a wedding to go to? Music? A little dancing? Victor's Becky. Wedding cake? You could have my piece, too. I don't know. I think I'd like a church wedding. If you did it again, you'd go that route, wouldn't you? Well, to tell you the truth, David, I don't remember the ceremony. But I remember every inch of that hotel room in the Poconos. <laughs> there was some wedding cake, huh? Oh, it was so romantic. Ginger radiant, Victor terrified and handsome. It's a good thing Marcus was there to prop him up. I still can't believe it. Victor, a family man. Soon there'll be the cry of littlest Becky's ringing throughout Manhattan. You and David danced a lot. I had extra energy. Oh, you sure did. The way you pushed and shoved to get that bouquet? I never pushed or shoved anybody. Christine, single women were being toppled right and left. You are very competitive. <laughs> 